Hi New Zealand, we're Drive EV in Topor and this is a really quick tour of the 2020 Kia Soul EV. The red cap's not just for style, we've got rails up there so you can put roof racks on there, you can put bike racks on there, you can put ski racks on there, you can put all kinds of racks on there. You've also got plenty of room in the boot for dogs, shopping, going to the dump. It's pretty much the closest we've got to an electric station wagon for quite some time. Moving inside the Kia Soul EV, you've got a lot of features that can make us really happy as drivers. We've got a clear driver information display with a heads up display as well, and a massive center screen, which can be a bit distracting at night, but you've got a great option to be able to just turn that off and keep your eyes on the road. If you're out on a road trip, you'll get 50 kilowatts from your standard charge net charger. If you're lucky enough to come across the new hyperchargers, you'll get up to 100 kilowatts from there. But most of your charging will be done at home through a seven kilowatt wall unit, or if you're just using a three pin plug, you'll pull two kilowatts. Either way, if you're using it around town, you're gonna to be able to charge up overnight. We have loads of range to play with and you can comfortably travel between cities on a single charge. Steve took this one from Taupo to Wellington the other week for the Green Expo and even with some really crappy weather along the way, he had plenty of juice left. The battery is big and liquid cooled so it should last a very long time and you won't need to give much thought to battery care. And that's the story on the 2020 Kia Soul EV.